Here we are, a little late start as usual. Totally, totally my fault today. No, it was mine. I was late. I know, but still. But then you changed. My friend, the, yeah, I had to change. Changed in the bathroom. I had to change into my 703 shirt. And portfolios. <laughs> Yeah, so my, and my printer decided to take a dive this morning, so I had to handwrite all my notes, and I felt like I was in high school, it was like cramming, it was... I know, and then you're like, oh my gosh, my hand hurts, I can't write anymore. I know, and my handwriting is absolutely ridiculous. It's so bad. <laughs> so if I don't know what I'm talking about here, I'll, I'll direct you to all their websites. <laughs> well, that always happens with me, um... I'll take notes when I'm in my listings from, from the brochures that we make up afterwards, and then like I think they they're legible, and the entire time my like, assistant's what like, that? "What does that say?" I'm like, "Can you see it?" <laughs> and then you're like, mm, "I don't know either." <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Well, happy Wednesday, everybody. Yes, and happy hump day. Happy hump day. And there's this isn't a holiday weekend. We've had so many holiday weekends. I know, We're and the now. kids are out now. Are out now. I know there's a lot of kid stuff going on this summer, but we haven't really, I, I haven't really researched it. So if you guys are interested in seeing something like that, let us know. No, what they're what they've got to watch then is the Instagram. Oh, with yes. the girls that'll be doing that. That's and cool. actually, it was supposed to be on Monday, and one of the girls got sick, oh. so we're doing it today. So I'm oh, doing good. this, and then I'm doing back an to back. Instagram live. After Where are you guys going to be? At their house. Oh, okay. We're just going to do it at their uh, house cool. for the first time. And it's live. Everybody, yep. Oh, live. on Instagram. Oh, I'll watch. No, no, I will say Instagram, I'm learning. So I'm learning about Instagram. And Instagram, um, I guess it's only live while you're watching it, and then it's gone. It's mm -hmm. almost like Snapchat. Like a, That's weird. Yeah, I'm like, that's a bummer. Like, I want to go back and see it. But, yeah. but we'll, we'll see, see how it goes. So I'll have to get my act together. Yeah. <laughs> what time are you doing that? Um, we're going to start it at 4. Four. Okay, yeah, awesome. So. Awesome. <laughs> awesome. So we'll have some kids stuff in. Excellent. Well, I will start, if okay. that's cool, yeah. and do Farm Brew, because that's the one that has the most. Okay. Um, so... Uh, Today is the 19th, right? Yes. yes. It's my parents' anniversary. Yes. Happy anniversary, Happy guys. Anniversary. I love you. I think they've been married 48 years. Oh, yeah. that's I think so that's sweet. right. That's if, if I'm wrong, I'm sorry, guys. They're still together. It's just so awesome. I know. It's really great. They're and they're so happy. They're so happy and in love. I love that. Yeah. So they've uh, set a shining example. Yeah, they, it's a different generation. It really is. <laughs> it really is. So today at 5 p.m. there's Freddie Long and. Tomorrow, yeah, tomorrow at 5 is Jason Mitchell. Um, the 21st is, so that's uh, Friday, is 2 p.m. is Nellie's Echo. Also on the 21st at 6.30 is Cashmere. Uh, Saturday at 11 a.m. is Hillary Veltry, which I think I know her. I think I met her at One Loud and then I, she works there, but oh, cool. she said that she's also a musician, so if that's where I think of. She, I, I think I saw her, one of her videos, and she was very good. So if it's the girl I'm thinking of, if not, it's because I'm tired and I've had a half a margarita. So. <laughs> <laughs> um, on um, the 22nd, which is still Saturday, 3 p.m., Sons of Pirates. That oh, sounds fun. Yeah. And then at 7 p.m., Beach Bones. So it sounds like they're having like maybe a Jimmy Buffett kind yeah, of vibe that there. Cool. I um, like that. I want to say Beach Bums might be a Beach Boys tribute band, but I'm not 100% sure. We'll have to check that out and let you guys know. Um, then on Sunday, Brian Frankie is uh, at 12 p.m. and I've seen him play many times at Quattro Goomba, and he's awesome. And then 4:30 um, on Sunday is Eddie Passa, and so that's it for Farm Brew. Cool. That's a lot of stuff. Farm Brew Live. Farm Brew Live. I know. It's I'm very, like it's very easy to get them messed up. <laughs> so I have um, on the 23rd, I think that Sunday at Eclipse at noon. I think this is super cool. Oh uh, yes. Yeah, they have the young entrepreneurs. Um, I'm so bad at saying that word. Entrepreneur. Say that French. Entrepreneur. Entrepreneur. Hi, <laughs> Michelle. Hi, Michelle. Happy birthday. Oh, it's Yay. Birthday. Happy birthday. And I think we can. Maybe announce this. Michelle's going to be your co-host next week. Yay! Yes. Well, you told me, but I wasn't 100 percent oh, sure. Okay. That it well, was, she so can, yay. and if you can, then yeah, we're, we are doing the thing. Yes. We're doing it's going to be awesome. Thing. So happy birthday, <laughs> Michelle. <laughs> um, so yeah. So the young entrepreneurs business fair. Like at first, I was kind of like, you know, I printed it off. And I didn't. Hey. I didn't think too much of it. 
but like the more I really think about it, I'm like, this is really a cool thing. Um, I didn't know too much about it, but it's a grassroots community initiative to just help um, innovation and entrepreneurship from local youth. So like, I guess there were girl, like one of the, the ladies that helped start this, her daughter maybe was doing like headbands or something with oh, cat ears or something cute. like that. And so I just think it, well, I, you know, we're both business owners, so I just think it's like super cool to be able to like, help kids with ideas that they yeah. might have at a younger age and like learn what you need to do And that for education it. that they're getting, just being, showing people what they have, you know, that education of getting out there in front of people, because I think a lot of kids don't know how to do that social part. Right. So, you know, to be in front of other, you know, other young entrepreneurs and people to coach them, that's huge. Right. Yeah. Well, and that's even like, I always tell people um, too, with me personally, like, when I got into real estate, I had no business background at all. I didn't even know what the Chamber of Commerce was. I didn't know what it was to network. I didn't know I what didn't a business know much plan about it either. was. I just started doing it, and I think, I would have been so far ahead if I was like these guys yes. and like learned how to put this stuff together. So, so cool. I think it's awesome. So cool. And I think they had, I think they had it last weekend too, because I saw some pictures. Or maybe Jason did a live. Oh, okay. So maybe it's an ongoing thing. I would love yeah. to just stop by it. Yeah. I don't know if I'll be able to, but I, that's, I think it's so cool. Um, that is hi, cool. Hi, Kathy. Hi. <laughs> um, oh, and then we've got... Oh, um, hi, Anne Marie. Anne Marie. Hi. Um, so we've got on the 22nd, which would be the Saturday at 7 p.m. at Eclipse, Rebelicious Reunion. Do you know anything about that? Okay, that. Revolutions with our friends Canavera and Trio 3. Revolutions is going to play together again for the first time in almost eight years. Oh, well, maybe cool. that's why it's a reunion tour. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah, so they're seeing old friends. What a great school for parents. Yes, I know. It's so true. Like the little elevator speeches yes. and things. That's like, huge. When you go to BNI's or whatever. Yes. And yourself. if they have that now, then when they go to like college interviews, it's, 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 yeah, it's, it's going to be helpful. like second nature to them. Yeah. It'll be awesome. Um, and then I've got on the 24th. Well, that was on like the oh, oh, this weekend for Eclipse. Eclipse. Did you um, today is that? line dancing. They, okay. Every, every I just Wednesday. just a weekend this time. Yeah. And then tomorrow lazy. is your band live and... Um, oh, and Friday is Fringe Benefits, okay. which is a local yeah, favorite. Yeah, I guess that one they're at, pull they're at nine. I'm glad you got that. Yep. And um, yep, that's all I have for Eclipse. Okay. Yeah. Um, and then I've got on the 21st the GM Fest Fridays um, live reggae on the patio for drinks and food on uh, at Rockwood, which oh, is Rockwood. again like nice. such a great kind of music to listen to at this time of year. Oh when yeah. When you want to be on vacation, but. You're not. I know. I know. <laughs> Are um, you going anywhere this summer? Um, we were gonna try and sneak away next week, and now we might not. Yeah. So I want to do something for the Fourth of July, but I don't have any things planned yet. So I'm like, maybe I'll just go camping or like. Yeah, I hate traffic so much. Tubing. Going to tubing. yeah. Uh, that's um, out at Harper's Ferry. They, yeah. Somebody was. Did we mention that last week? Harper's Ferry. Yeah. Somebody mentioned Harper's Ferry Brewing Company. Um, they have the tubing tours down there. Yeah. So it's not far out of town. You don't right. have to deal with a ton of traffic. So um, I'll probably end up just going to Vanish because it's like going out of town and we have. Um, oh, and Vanish just opened a coffee shop and pastry bar. And oh, that's to awesome. go with like all the other cool stuff they have there. Yeah. So that's kind of my out of town destination. There. Yeah, it's really cool. We'll, we'll make a field trip one. Yeah. It's so fun. <laughs> <laughs> um, want to switch oh yeah to so um eavesdrop brewery is having their anniversary party saturday at 12 p.m and then uptown alley friday is the reflex which of course everybody loves the reflex yes, wear your 80s gear dress like madonna do your thing um saturday is vinyl invention which a friend of mine told me that they're really really good i haven't seen them yet but she's followed them for years and they've been around for a while and she says they're wonderful I think next time we mention the reflex, we should have pictures of ourselves printed out from when we were in the 80s. Oh my god, I've got a great, <laughs> what we look like. I've got a great Cindy Lauper Halloween costume. <laughs> it's so good, it's so good. And then uh, Sunday at Uptown Alley is Salsa Sundays at 8 p.m. Okay. Oh, and before I put this page down, if I can read my handwriting, Sinistral this weekend is Joe Sinistral. Downer. Uh, it's Saturday at 7. Uh, Sunday they're having a flag, um, a red, white, and blue American flag um, palette painting party. I saw that. At 2 p.m. And then uh, this Friday is their first, I, I think they're having first Friday, but it didn't say what band. So maybe, oh, maybe it's just the first Friday of every month. 
So that might be it. Okay. Yeah, I think that's yes. it. Yes. Um, but they usually have music on Friday. So again, Stacy will jump in and, and tell us what's going on. Okay. She's always good about correcting us if we <laughs> if we get off track or forget something. <laughs> Um, I have on the 23rd at Mazda 29, they have um, their weekly meetup where they do, it's the Mopar Club, so it's like, a, I'm assuming some sort of a car type show oh, cool. thing. I haven't been to Mazda yet. Oh, really? I haven't oh, been there. gotta go. Yes, and one of my friends that used to work at Firebirds is now at Mazda, so I'm gonna have to go see her. And yeah, it's out. cool. There's kind of like a group of people that like hang out there. Like, um, I know like Ash from Ash. Oh, oh cool. cool. And that's right I'm, in Old Town? Oh, um, no, Mazda's in that little strip behind the new Bellman store. 129? We're across from Wawa? In Gainesville. Oh, oh, okay. Why am I thinking it's an, I'm thinking of somebody else? Yeah, maybe you are. Have okay. you been to that one though? You gotta go to that one if you haven't. No, I, I haven't go been to that, that too. They have great like cocktails, like. Oh, is it? The, it's the same thing. This is just a new location. I'm so confused. I'm no, sorry. Okay, so Maza, <laughs> it's it's at Maza. It's at the same place, but they're having like a car show. Oh, in front of it. that's gotcha. probably what's throwing me okay, off. That it's yeah. a restaurant. It's definitely not the tequila that's throwing me off. <laughs> it's don't been a long day already. Don't mind us. I know. <laughs> so yeah, um, I think, and I think like Mopar has to do with the type of car, like oh. the, the engine that's in a Dodge or a certain, it's not in Ford. I'm very Chevy. impressed that you know this. <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> and then June 23rd, there's the um, Gainesville Farmer's Market at 10 a.m. That's on um, Sunday. So I think that that's the game, the farmer's market that said um, Gainesville United Methodist Church. Oh, okay. Yeah, that there's something like back there. It doesn't have the, the address to this on, on my printout. I'm sure it's just the way it printed off. Yeah. Um, I'm sure the information's there. But you, uh, they have produce and hot foods, baked goods, um, live music cooking demonstrations, kids events, and more. How fun. Uh, so that's fun. Um, 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 throwback Thursdays of rock with us. I lied. I guess I didn't. I guess I did print off more than the weekend. Look All at right. you go, girl. I'm, I'm glad I'm to so catch proud of myself. You're picking up my slack <laughs> today. <laughs> so June the 20th, that's tomorrow at 9 a.m. They have Throwback Thursdays at Rockwood, and then let's see here. I got. On the 21st, so I'm like all over the place. My stuff's not in a very good order today. Um, live music by Bradical and Kim Provise um, at Tin Cannon on Friday the 21st, 7 to 9. That says they're excited to have them back in the tap room performing live music for you. There's no cover charge, so come early, grab a seat and a beer, and be prepared to be entertained by this talented duo. Awesome. Yeah, so a new one to check and out. I'm impressed that you could say Radical and Kimprovise. <laughs> <That's funny. laughs> well, I don't know if I'm saying it That's right. Funny. I, I, I like I, that. I got something out of awesome. it. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> Um, All right, I have the farm at Broad Run. Do you yeah, have do that okay, one. Okay, so we've got um, on Saturday Nathaniel Davis from 6 to 9, and uh, Sunday is just south of 7 from 4 to 7 p.m. Cool. Oh, and Quasi Flannel is at the LMB Grill, which used to be Lion and Bull oh, right yeah. there on Haymarket. So okay. that's some Haymarket stuff. And, and now they're putting it under LMB Grill. So LMB Grill, so it'll be easy to find it. <laughs> and then Dog Day at LaGrange is Friday at 4 p.m. So there's some Haymarket stuff. Oh yeah, I saw it. There's a. Um, it says it's a Virginia German Shepherd rescue event. Oh nice! Yes. I love those rescue events. And I love German Shepherds. They're so cute. Yeah, they are. And they're so like. I don't know. Well, obviously, if the police train them. They're just such I great know. dogs. They're smart to dogs too. Mm -hmm. I love that. Um, it says we would love if you would stop by for a visit to learn about DGSR, which is the rescue organization for the um, German Shepherds, and they're. And their mission, their volunteers will be happy to answer any questions you may have and talk to you about the breed. So if you like German Shepherds or you just like German Shepherds, head on down. I do. <laughs> All I have is stupid cats that are destructive and awful. Cats are not stupid. They're oh, smart. They're mean though. <laughs> mine, mine clearly hate me. <laughs> I always say mine. I think mine. I think mine has another family. Because they're indoor, outdoor, and like. The one time I saw, my, this is 
terrible. To <laughs> they leave and you're like, make good choices. Well, oh, no, come back. Well, okay, so, so the one I see him maybe like every five days. Really? He's, he just doesn't come back a lot. Of course, it's a, like our favorite one. Oh my god. And he's got long fur, so I noticed one day he had like these little like matted things like in, in the tufts that come out here. Yeah. And I was like, oh, I've got to grab him and cut those off. And he ran off and I couldn't. The next time he came back, they weren't there. So that's why I was like, some family's probably like grooming him. Like, this cat's a nightmare train wreck running around the neighborhood. Even with these mats. <laughs> he probably has like five different names, too. Yeah. It's so funny. <laughs> oh my god, I love that. Um, Okay, this is cool. At Park Valley Church on um, June 21st, they're having at 5.30 p.m. It's like an elementary sports camp. I don't know if there's anything more that you... It says, join us for a fun week of sports camp. This will be a high-energy camp filled with quality sports instruction. And then, of course, it says see more cut off. But I'm assuming it's probably something that you would need to go and register. You can't just show up there. But you right. need to register right. for the camp and everything. But it seems like there's a lot of fun camps going on. Yeah, there's summer. a lot of good stuff for the kids to get involved in. So keep them busy. Keep them out of your hair. Yeah. But it does make it hard when they're like, half the day. And they're like, wanting them, like... All over the place. Yeah, like that. Yeah. Just when your day gets started, you're like, yeah. Yeah. Mine's doing swim early, but she's pretty much missed every practice. <laughs> she's just, she wants to go have fun, and so it's like, it's hard for a kid. It's hard You know, the first age. couple weeks, I'm like, eh, go have fun. Yeah. yeah. But she went to the Air and Space Museum with my parents today. So, oh, well, so it's not like it's she's educational. Just it's fun. Yep. Yeah, she's doing watch something TV. cool. Yep. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. And did I mention, I just found this, did I mention One Hot Mess was at Sinistro on June 21st, Friday? Um, oh, that's right. I'll I said, pretend like you did. No, I said Stacy would jump because in and say. I didn't know. Yes. I don't remember. Yes, so local <laughs> favorite One Hot that's Mess terrible. is at Sinistro. I know. I, I swear my, I listened to every word you say. <laughs> my mojo is just off today for some reason. I think it started with the printer and now I just can't get it back. That's okay. Well, yes. knows so that. that was, yeah, I said, this um, is I said Stacy would tell us what was going on. It's not First Friday, but One Hot Mess is going to be there. <laughs> I, I had a feeling maybe I didn't say that. Um, and that's pretty much all I have except for, of course, my shameless plug. Yeah, and, do yours. Um, well, and also I another plug. I have anything left over. Okay. And then another plug. Um, a lot of my friends are going to be doing, um, if, if you guys remember back in May, I did Chicks Picks, which is a big craft festival, and there's lots of ladies yep, that, I that. that have you know handmade jewelry and all kinds of fun stuff. Well, they're having a pop-up shop um, on June 21st and June 22nd at Chefscape in Leesburg. Which I, I also have a friend, that Jenny, out. that she's one of the owners there, and she's super awesome. And it's it's a very collaborative, cool place, and it's right in that Wegman shopping center. So Chicks Picks will be there this weekend, along with all the other stuff that they have. And I think they have, like, rotating chefs that come through. And yeah, I saw Inside Loud and has yes. done, yes. like, did a live or a video from there. Yes. Just, like, so course, Chicks Picks is... They're always at, like, the super, right. like, yeah. best places ever. Oh, like, okay. I want to be in some... Oh, and we forgot to mention, we're at one of the best places ever. We are at Uncle Julio's today. Did we even mention Uncle Julio's? We did. House. And I was just talking to the bartender, Brandon, who's super nice. Makes a really good skinny... Hi, Bob. Oh, hi. Hey. What a hot mess. <laughs> um, so, uh, Brandon said that they do have happy hour here Monday through Friday from 4.30 to 6.30. And every day, even on the weekends, they have a margarita of the day. And today is the peach margarita. I didn't try it, but I, I always get the skinny margaritas. Well, here's, I'll show you the picture of the one that I like. I like the that one the, with the watermelon oh, in there that's like that fresh. Looks so good. Um, but that's the fresh margarita of the day, so it changes out. Uh, but I always yeah. like the picture. I'm like, I, love the, I like the swirlies with the I like sangria. That it's pink. Yeah. Oh, no. that's so pretty. <laughs> um, yeah, but all their stuff's good. Actually, my favorite one here is. Um, of course, it's the El Jefe one. I guess it's strong because oh. it says you can only have two. Um, That's so weird. I don't like limitations like that. I know, right? But it's um, <laughs> it's got the ancho chilies in them. And, oh, um, you like the spicy stuff? Yeah, like yeah. a little bit of a bite to it. So it's, I think that you're very brave good. when it comes to cocktails. <laughs> I love that. I love that. Um, oh, and so. Um, so definitely come and see Brandon here at Uncle Julio's, and of course the food and drinks, everything is wonderful. Um, and so my shameless plug for the week, I'm not playing music this weekend, which is, it feels weird. But it's, it's, maybe it's nice to have a weekend off. It is. You it know, is. It's like been just kind of a, a, a marathon. you have nothing planned. Yes, exactly. But I'll probably go see some music. Um, actually, my husband's playing at Vanish on Saturday. Oh, cool. So I'll probably go out there and check that out. Um, and then... Uh, 
obviously, Nelly Pops at Vanish every weekend. I mention that every weekend, but it's always worth saying because yeah. it's such a fun spot. Um, we're also at Quattro Goomba Saturday and Sunday from 12 to 6. And then I'm doing this really cool event. It's um, Eastgate Orthodontics um, is in Chantilly, and I'm doing a teen fashion show. I love that. Yeah, oh, it's cool. cool. You should do a fashion show. Yeah, and I, I forgot that I was doing this one, and it's for teens, I guess, like the orthodontic patients. Um, so I'm going to be dressing them in lollipop clothing and accessories. Oh, that's fun. And it's um, right off Route 50 in Chantilly, like a little bit closer to South Riding by Social House. I don't know if you know where that is. Yeah. There's yeah. Paris Teeter, and it's right off 50 before you kind of get into Aldi. Okay, so, well, and, and that's on. from 11 to 2, and it's open to the public. They said to invite. Well, what, Steph wants people. us on her podcast. I'm gonna be on her podcast. Oh, Let's yay. do it. Let's do it. I love that. <laughs> yes, please. Yes, please. I love it. Because a lot of the stuff that I do crosses over with Latin yeah. stuff. So there's yeah. always things that are going on in both. So uh, yeah, anything like that sounds awesome to me. So that's all I've got. Okay. Well, I've got a couple more. Here's one for. Here's one for the moms. Um, preschool story time uh, at Cookies and Cream. They have. I think they. Oh, it's. Uh, uh, every Friday, I think probably all summer. Uh, <clears throat> um, so it's Friday at 12.30 at Preschool Stories time. Um, they share a few books uh, and have board games sometimes, some people dress in costumes. And then, let's see what else I had. I think they also, um, I, I don't have it printed off, but at the Gateway, or the, the movie theater that we have here in Gainesville, oh, the Regal, the Regal yeah, it, they have, I, I think it's, I don't know if it's... Uh, I'm gonna say the wrong day. I think it's Wednesdays, but they have they're starting those movies up where they're in the, the discount free or yeah, the discount cheap. movies, yeah, yeah. For, yep. for people to do all in the summer, which is cool. that's awesome. I gotta find out what day that is because my daughter needs to get out. <laughs> she her obsession all last summer, and she's just jumped right back into it. She watches Tom and Jerry every morning at breakfast, and then she ends up watching Tom and Jerry all day while well, working. That's and I'm a like, good one. I know, it's kind of violence, but at least she's like hearing classical music and stuff. Right, right. <laughs> like, oh, mom of the year. <laughs> um, then, I, well, I, this was kind of neat that was printed off it, that they, they came up. It was on June 23rd, Sunday at 9 a.m. Um, at the at Manassas Battlefields. They're having um, Battlefield Equestrian Society. Join Battlefield Equestrian Society and Black Horse Calvary. Fourth Virginia Cavalry for a guided historical ride in the Manassas Battlefield. I'm like, do you get to ride horses? That would be cool. Yeah, that's fun. I don't know. Yeah. Check it out if you want to see. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Um, <laughs> oh, hey, Dwight. Oh, Dwight's going to be here. Hey. Dwight will be here in 15 minutes. Oh. So excited. <laughs> I went to elementary and high school with Dwight. <laughs> Met each other forever. I, I know Dwight from uh, the real estate industry. So right, so, right. Uh, Excellent. Yeah, they're... So I, Steph sounds like she, with her podcast, maybe you do stuff with, um, like, talking about little kids. I don't know. Let us know. Let us know what your podcast is. We'll do it. Um, Definitely. <laughs> then we've got, let's see, anything else of interest. There's the Warrington Farmer's Market. I went there. I actually was going to do a shout out last week. I forgot. Um, but I took Ryan there oh, last Saturday nice. morning. Yeah, we got the Spreed's Biscuit Company or something. Ooh. We got their biscuits. They're like all homemade. They're huge. Oh, they're super nice. good. Nice. Um, oh, that's what else. That may be it. There's um, the 21st. I think another thing I think you have to register for um, is it's a leader cast event. Um, I actually went to this like. Oh, gosh, it's so bad when you get older. You're like, was that a year ago or three years ago? It, it, <laughs> it all blends. It all blends. It all same, but I went to it before. Um, you, it's basically like a day-long thing where you, it's at the um, Fauquier Health and Center in, within like where the hospital is in the Oh, okay. And they do, it's this leader gas training, and it's basically like helping people become leaders in this in our society and community and also like companies and things like that. So it's a lot of great information. Um, um, I guess that's, I think that should be it. Yeah, some of the other stuff, like the information come off, so I hate that. Yeah, and mine just printed out stuff that was local, and the only thing that I thought was really exciting is Air Supply is coming to town. That really dates me, but I love oh, Air, Air Supply. Air Supply is good. Yeah, they're coming to MGM, so 
there's one thing that I open up and it just shows all the local events. Cool. Like, oh man, I want to go to Air Supply. <laughs> you want to go with me? <laughs> yes. I'm such a nerd. I'm there. The most I'm such a nerd. That. I know. I know. <laughs> it dates me a little bit, but I love that. <laughs> so we didn't do, we didn't go out too far. Short, short sweet one this week. Um, Thanks, fight. <laughs> check out, uh, check out the Instagram live if you get a get time this afternoon um, to see the like teen episode again it's their first one so please forgive us yes. if we're... it's gonna be awesome yeah it's gonna be amazing yeah it's gonna be flawless it's go off without a hitch <laughs> just um, <laughs> like everything we do um, so like every time we get together I mean right. there's never any mistakes it's, it's, we're killing it every time <laughs> so I guess that's it so thanks everybody for tuning in this week um, again let us know if you guys do anything cool if you have pictures you want us to post Anything you want us to share, send it our way. We'll do our best to get it out there. And yep. have a great weekend. Bye, guys. Bye. Have a great weekend.